Hi friends, good morning. Please look at the next problem in boats and streams. Friends, a motor boat. Friends, problem is given in the description box. See friends, a motor boat travels 40 kilometers upstream and 60 kilometers downstream in 13 hours. And the same motor boat travels 50 kilometers upstream and 72 kilometers downstream in 16 hours. So, what is the speed of the boat in standstill water? That is, we have to find x. x is equal to ds plus us by 2. This thing we know. So, say this is equation 1, say this is equation 2. By solving these two equations, we can find us and ds and then you can find x. See friends, I am multiplying the first equation by 5 and second equation by 4. I am trying to equate these two terms, us terms. 540 is 200 kilometers US plus 560 is 300 kilometers DS. It takes 513 is 65 hours. The same way 450 is 200 kilometers US plus 472 is 428, 47 is 28, 288 kilometers downstream in 416 is 64 hours. By subtracting uh, these two equations, we get 300 minus 288, 12 kilometers downstream. 12 kilometers downstream, it takes uh, 65 minus 64, 1 hour. So, 12 kilometers downstream in one, 1 hour means uh, downstream speed. Downstream speed is equal to ds is equal to 12 km pH. 12 km pH. Let us substitute this ds value in equation 1. 40 kilometers upstream, 40 kilometers upstream plus 60 kilometers downstream can be traveled in 5 hours. Speed of speed in downstream is 12. 60 by 12 takes 5 hours. Plus 5 hours is equal to 13 hours. 40 kilometers upstream is equal to 13 minus 5, 8 hours. 40 kilometers in 8 hours. 40 kilometers in 8 hours means US speed 40 by 8, 5 km pH. US is equal to 8, 5, 5 km pH. Now we want X. X is equal to DX plus US by 2. 12 plus 5, 17. 17 by 2, 8.5 km pH is your answer, friends. 8.5 km pH. Thank you, friends.